hi guys welcome back to my channel i figured i'd try to do a quick video <laughs> especially from elijah and jackie they wanted to see my bead um box the thing i bought from amazon which i want to say i think i need to buy another one anywho here is which i showed you before in my video my beads so this is me putting away my beads that i've collected or bought from um, Hobby Lobby. I had forgotten that quick where I got it from. So I figured um, you guys could watch me put the stuff away. So basically, I'm just going to put all these beads in here. And I'm having a hard time opening. I didn't realize that it would be that difficult. Oops, sorry, I dropped the camera. Sorry for that, see? So now those are in there, which I think I should have not put them in there. Anyway, if I read, if I need to put them somewhere else, then um, I can have my six-year-old help me. So here is Oh, my big container which <laughs> it doesn't even fit it doesn't even fit in the pro <laughs> you see so we're gonna take this off section by section so this is the top so if I get another one of these which it looks like I will um, they will stack up on each other so on the first oops shelf I have all my little bead making stuff which I do have more and it's in another container but this is my dangle that Jackie got me and I have it there oh I don't even know where to start but anywho I wanted to put these beads away and that I got from Hobby Lobby. These, I don't know. I don't want to put them in a jar. I think, I think, you know what? I think that's a better idea. Just buying another one of these big containers to put them in. I think that's going to work best. Here are some of the charms that I got that didn't make the haul because they were in another bag and I missed it and I was like oh I had a whole nother bag of stuff but it's okay it's all right so all right let's move this out of the way I I should have the you know the thought process you're seeing it all from scratch um so let me move some stuff around here's the second container um have just some random stuff here this uh, candy cane bead I made but I didn't glue it down yet but I figured I would do this eyelash trim which I thought was good it glue it down onto this candy cane so and then I have I don't know acrylic little I don't know what you call these, but they're little signs. And then my little bows. Most of these little bows are from Jackie from my shop. And then I have here little tassels. And so I got some tassels from Hobby Lobby. So you know what? I'm going to put those in there. These didn't make the, the haul, but these were on sale. So I'm going to put those in there. And then my little, little, little tassels. But yeah, I think I'm gonna have to definitely get another one of these because I have a lot of charms. And then you know what, these big tassels I got, I think I'm gonna put them in there because they're big and there's three of them. And then these bracelets that I bought that I think I'm gonna use, not as bracelets, but use the material from them. 
So I put them in there in the big one. And then here's some more. I do have a lot of little, little tassels that that's it. Oh, and then I got some more in this packet that came with the seed beads. Oh, here's another big of the seed beads on the letters. So these tassels, you know what? I'm just going to cut. Cut it open and put it in. These are very springy colored, springy colored, right? And put those in there. Oh. And then, let's see what I have here. I have these corner pieces. These corner pieces. That I got, I don't think they made the haul either. So I'm just going to put those in there. All right, so that's what I had on the first one. And then here's the second one. And I had some butterflies and then some of these beads. Oh, I do have, I had a little small section of beads. And now I don't know what I did with them. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, we'll get back to that because I'm just scattered brains right now. All right. And then we have the third row of beads. So these, um, some were gifted. Some I bought already wired wrap and some I did my own like this one I did myself so oh yeah and I did buy which didn't make the haul a whole bunch of the little balls uh, cotton, well, I want to say cotton balls but they're not and I don't know they're in the bag but to make little dangles so a lot of these were already gifted and or I did um or bought and then here's some beads and then there's really, I try to assort them or organize them in a way that I would know, but I lost, lost that because I didn't have more room. So I need more room. And then here, so I definitely am going to have to get a bigger one. And then... Here are some flat bags or cabochons. <laughs> Look at these, are cute. These are like cupcake, like whipped cream, I would say. And then here are some lollipops. And then these little cute little dinosaurs. And then all these are bows and most of these are flowers and these are buttons. And then these are just charms whole bunch of different charms these as well and these are red beads so oh look I had a tassel I missed one. Oh, I missed a few look at that how did I do that see I'm like scattered brains anyway um so excuse the noise in the background the kids I told them to but I need to do a quick video which I don't think this is gonna be a quick video um, because I really need to really think about how I'm gonna do these so these are these hearts I got or bought I have to stop using got that word anywho um, I don't know where I would put them in here with the reds right um, I got a butterfly okay I do have a lot of charms that I would put in here, but look, it's really getting piled up there. So yeah, I'm gonna have to rethink this. But anyway, I'll just show you. I'll just show you what I have here. And then this is what the fifth, whoops, I took this out. Oh, there's the little one-year-old trying to get in here. Here's another glass beads. 
These are cute flower beads. These are little, they remind me of little circus balls, but in pastel colors. And then here are some bunny. Here's some stars. And then here are more flatback cabochons. These are bow beads. I don't like that they're on the side. Sorry about that. Kids fighting with each other. So this is number five. I don't know if I stated that. There's some heart, which I could probably put some heart or move these with all the heart beads. And then I have, I have like bells in here and I don't know how this got in here these balls but they're in here so I'm just gonna leave them in there for now until I'm definitely gonna have to reorganize that section and then here's some more cabochons I think this is like little fruits in which I saw cherry in here I'm gonna I saw another cherry somewhere else so I'm gonna have to put that and these are like the candy well these are candy beads and then little I think these are like little nail, but there's a candy little brick candy. I think these were like the nail jewelry. And more candy beads. Candy, basically. There's some more beads, stars, and hearts. And this is like more Christmassy stuff, even though it's pink. I love pink. So I have that. That's how I organized that. And then this is the last one. And these are all skulls because my mom likes skulls. So I got flat backs and then these little charms. Actually, see. So she's a skull lady. So I figured I put those there. And then yeah, so this is kind of organized, but not really. Look at oh look at I have. I have here, I have keys and feathers, right? And I do have some more keys, but these are neon, but you know what? I'm gonna keep the keys together because that will work for me. And then these are like birthstone jammies. Well, what do you call it? ring charms I'm sorry guys this is just I guess I should have prepared re myself better for making this video but <laughs> my life show she's so funny she's like I'm still waiting to see the your bead collection or char so it's charm beads cabochons flatbacks all of the goodies so yeah I think that's how I'm going to do that. So that's the very last one. And I don't know yeah, how I'm going to do this, but I think I need to order another container ASAP. But this really works really well and they are stackable. You can stack it as high as you like. And it was like really cheap. It is 24. Uh, let's see. So seven, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, for seven containers, and I love it. It's awesome. The only thing I don't like is because I don't know where everything is, and I'm like constantly trying to get it. And you see through it, but you don't. I mean, you you could see through it, but then you really like. Ah, oh, you have to really look to know what. But yeah, so that is all that's in this pink container. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have a better way um, of organizing this. Or if you have any uh, advice, I would love to hear it. So please do uh, leave, leave that down below comment down below and I hope you guys have a great and fabulous day and I do have actually 
two more videos or actually I'm gonna combine I have a video after this one um, I might just post it all together but I have a, a AliExpress haul and uh, Brenda from live dot I don't remember what her name was Let's see. love craft um, she had Easter stuff so I had gotten it I had bought it because I was like oh I'm not gonna get this Aliexpress stuff until a month a month later and actually it came within the two weeks I think they're they're in competition with uh, Temu or Temu I however you want to say it and so yeah I got it really fast so actually I got them on the same day so that's so funny so look for that it'll be out shortly within a day or two. All right, guys. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.